When I was nine years old, my mom and dad split up. It was a pretty big deal, but I didn't know how to talk about it. Some of my friends' parents were divorcing, and they seemed to do okay with it, but I thought my world was being ripped apart. I just don't love you anymore. Why can't you give this just one more try? I started packing things away. Maybe I would run away. Maybe I just wanted to protect the things I love the most and have them close to me all the time. Why are you being so unreasonable? Joint custody was not my idea. I carried my suitcase to school, friends' houses, to church, everywhere I went, really. And for a couple of years, no one saw it, or so I thought. And then one Sunday at church, my class teacher asked me about it. She said, Annie, it looks like you're carrying a heavy load there. I told her it wasn't heavy because it was all the things I loved. And I opened it up a little bit to show her what was inside. I tried to tell her about Little Bear and how scared he was sometimes. But instead of helping me, she gave me this big Bible and she crammed it inside my bag and she told me that if I would accept Jesus, everything would get better. But I never saw Jesus. <laughs> I just got the Bible. And it made my bag heavier. I tried to concentrate on my schoolwork, but I couldn't. I had so many bags. I had teachers who put a lot of pressure on me. Annie, you have so much potential. They kept telling me how smart I was and how if I would just study more and work harder, I would make better grades and I could get into a really good college, which I really wanted to do. I know, I know they couldn't see all that I was already carrying, so they loaded me up with all the books I would need to learn what I needed to know. There was this one kid in my math class. We talked sometimes. Hi, Annie. And then one day he put a gun to his head. A bunch of us attended the service and all I could think was, he probably had a lot of bags like me, and he just wanted to blow them away. Then someone told me about Jesus. I said, oh no you don't. I'm still lugging around a big Bible in this bag and all it is is heavy. No thanks. They said, Jesus said, come to me, anyone who is tired of carrying all their bags, <laughs> right? Who isn't? Come to me and I will give you rest. <laughs> How? I'm so tired. <laughs> and they said, Look. Look. What? His arms. So? They're open. They were nailed open. So you could put your bags on them. I can't. Then lay them at his feet. They will come off me. They will come off. I've been carrying them for so long.
Put them on him. I can't. I can't. Now I can trade these ashes in for beauty. the fuck?